what is their plan and how badly did we see you know transport get affected today Well, uh, today it's uh, too early to speak about the kind of impact that uh, this indefinite strike has had. Over 95 lakh, uh, you know, commercial vehicles, including tempos uh, and uh, uh, buses, school buses, even along with truckers, have gone on an indefinite strike starting today after uh, talks with the central government with Nitin Gadkari yesterday failed. Was inconclusive, according to the All India Motor Transport Congress, which is organizing this protest. We saw school buses. Association, in fact, also join in this one-day strike. They have pledged their support starting tomorrow. However, they will not be, uh, you know, uh, uh, joining the protest, is what we understand. But. Over 93,000 uh, truckers will still continue to go on strike until their demands are met. A couple of major demands that they have: one, to bring in fuel uh, under GST because they say most of their input costs, 60% of their input input cost goes away in this abnormal hike, is what they're calling it. They also say that uh, uh, the toll policy must be transparent. This is something that we saw in 2015 as well, when uh, transport organisations had gone on strike for. Nearly five days uh, when Nitin Gadkari uh, had also promised them that this uh, eBay uh, toll would be brought about, they weren't very happy with that, and they uh, alleged that none, all of those promises were not kept, which is why they're going on an indefinite strike. Now, over the next couple of days is when we'll really be able to see the kind of impact on essential commodities, including vegetables and milk. Yeah, that's what we will have to wait and watch out for. Has there been any response, Amita, so far from uh, you know the government authorities uh, on the strike, and especially on the demands of diesel price uh, being lowered? Well, so far there has been no response apart from the meeting that took place yesterday where truckers associations have told us, uh, 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 you know, uh, to, uh, we've spoken to them today this morning and they told us that that uh, meeting was inconclusive. As far as today is concerned, according to the truckers association, uh, the government was all, all more interested in the uh, no confidence portion that we're talking about. So they said that they, this is something that they uh, could perhaps happen. They're pushing for a meeting over the next couple of days. But until their demands are met, these are the two major demands that we're talking about. Until that is met, they say that they're going to go on an indefinite strike. All right.